Hey, they want trouble pulling up, yes, I'm catching. Bins on my pants, and you know that I'm flashing. Lock, lock on my side, and you know I ain't about action. Just left the bank, I had good satisfaction. A1 trap, I'm a A1 trapper. 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 A1 trap, I'm pulling up, yes, I'm catching. Bins in my pants, and you know that I'm flashing. Lock on my side, and you know I ain't about action. Just left the bank, I had good satisfaction. A1 trap, I'm a A1 trapper. Trapper, A1 trapper, I'm a A1 trapper. A1 trapper, I'm a A1 trapper. A1 trapper, I'm a A1 trapper. Fuck a 12, can't throw the 12. Run up on me, bet you catching shells. Catch me a option, bet I'm like some mail. Got me a glock in case niggas tell. Baby girl, come ride the wave. Talking to a face, girl, you need to behave. Y'all complicated, I just like a maze. Roll me up, but now I'm smoking blue haze. Be my brave brother, he like it. What's good, YT? It's your boy T Floss, aka Mr. 242, aka 242's A1 Shooter. Come back to you guys with another video. And I'm sorry, guys, but you got 150 likes on the last video. And here's the dribble tutorial. Let's get 200 likes on this video for the ultimate dribble tutorial. Every move will be inside this video. Now, the first thing you want to do is put on these signature styles. And the first move we'll look at is the crossover size up. To do the crossover size up, all you need to do is the ball is in your left hand, flick the right, flick the right stick right to left, and the ball is in your right hand, flick it left to right. And now the next move is the Kobe Bryant and Kyle Lowry spam. Now to do this, you need the Kobe Bryant between the legs, which I told you to put on. Now what you have to do is to do the between the legs is flick the right stick. If the ball is in your left hand, flick the right stick diagonally down right and then down and. That's how you do the between the legs. So practice doing that. Practice doing that motion. Practice doing that. And the ball's in your right hand. Flick it diagonally down left and then down. I'll put the, the controller on the screen. You guys can know. Just practice spamming that. When you get a good hang of it, then the crossover size up. I already showed you how to do that. Hitting them six. You have to do it slow and then fast. So, it's so you can gradually learn how to do it. The next move we'll look at is the momentum behind the back. And in the last video, I showed you guys how to momentum. So if you didn't watch that video, watch that video right now. Two more. All we have to do, all we have to do the momentum behind the back is momentum. The ball is in your right hand. You want to momentum, and then flick the right stick down, and then hold the turbo button, and then flick the left stick dangling upright. And next move we'll look at is the behind, the moving behind the back. And all we have to do is while standing still, flick the right stick. Oh, if the ball is in your right hand. Flick the right stick down, and as soon as like a half a second, as soon as you flick it down, hold turbo and run in the right direction. And the next move we'll look at, you guys will need to put on the Kyle Lowry between the legs size up, and you need to put on a leap to do the momentum spin. There are three variations. All you have to do is momentum and then flick the right stick and do it in a full circle. All right, that's all you have to do. And then you'll get the animation, the, either the wide animation or the animation where you stay in place. Now to do the animation where you stay in place, all you have to do is flick, flick momentum and then flick the right stick in a full circle while holding the left stick down. And then once you do a spin in place, then you want to flick the right stick down. And to do the momentum triple spin, all you have to do is, I mean the momentum triple spin, yeah, all you have to do is... Momentum spin, do a half spin, and then do a full spin. And that's how you do the triple spin. Now, if you still are confused on how to do a half spin, you can go on the controls on NBA 2K17, and it, told you, and it tells you how to do a half spin. And to do the momentum between the legs, the fast, fast momentum between the legs in one spot, what you have to do is flick the right stick, momentum, and then flick the right stick between the legs without holding the left stick. Alright, you want to be holding turbo, but not the left stick. You want to momentum and then flick the right stick between your legs while holding turbo. So if the ball is in your right hand, you want to flick the right, you want to momentum and then flick the right stick diagonally down left while holding turbo and then it's just vice versa. Next move we'll look at the hop step, hop back, the quick hop back. Now this is very effective, I use this in almost every combo I do. And all you have to do, if the ball is in your right hand, you want to flick the right, you want to tap box and then flick the left stick diagonally down right. And the ball is in your left hand, you want to tap square and flick the ball diagonally down left. Simple. The next move we'll look at is the momentum half spin. Now what you want to do is, once you do the momentum spin, what you want to do is spin again, but do it in a half spin, all right? Do not, you know how you fully do the spin for a momentum spin? You want to do that again half, and a half, you want to do the half of that, all right? 
You want to start at the, si the same place where you did the full spin. You want to do that and then do a half spin. Not a full spin, but a half spin. Now, the next move is the lead three moves. And what you have to do is a hezzy the hop step. Now, to do this, all you have to do is hold turbo and flick the right stick towards the ball hand and then hop step. It's that simple. If you don't know how to hop step, it's just tap square and then move the left stick in any direction. To do the next elite three move, which is the hop, the elite three, then hop step, what you want to do is flick the right stick to your non ball hand and then hop step as soon as you do it, bro, and you'll get that fast animation. Now, to do this elite three glitch, all you have to do is what you want to do is flick the right stick towards your ball hand and then flick it to your non ball hand very quickly, and that's how you do the glitch. That's all you have to do to do that. Now, to do the lead three hop, all you have to do is flick the right stick towards your non ball hand. Once again, all you have to do is hold the right stick, flick it up, and once you get the jumping animation, do it once, one more time, and then run it in the direction the ball is in. Now, to do the momentum span, this is the hardest move in 2K right now, but I've mastered it. I haven't mastered it, but I can do it like a, at a relatively like consistent pace. Now, what you want to do is to do fast momentum, instead of flicking the right, all you have to do is do if the ball's in your right hand flick the right stick diagonally down left and then and then flick the left stick towards the direction you did the right stick all right and you'll get the fast momentum animation once you get the fast momentum animation what you want to do is keep on doing that fast okay guys and the best size up to use is elite five that's the easiest one to spam momentum with but what i recommend doing is best practice doing the fast momentum now once you do the fast momentum just practice doing the fast Once you have mastered the fast momentum, then you wanna do do not try to spam momentum yet. Just do the fast momentum in place and keep and keep doing it. Do it at a slow rate. And then when you think you got the hang of it, start speeding up, alright guys? Let's go in a straight line and do it. And you see you hear me, I'm spamming right now. So that's all you gotta do, guys. I mean, and the last move we'll look at for the tutorial is the momentum between the legs behind the back. I'll show you seeing I run you kill two, kill two niggas with this move. Now what you want to do is momentum, then put the ball between your legs, and then do a behind the back move. Alright? It's that simple, guys. It's that simple. That's how to do it. This is how to do the momentum behind the back cancellation. Now to do the momentum behind the back cancellation, who's you're gonna have the momentum? In order to momentum it if the ball's in your right hand, flick the right stick to your left hand and as soon as you do that whole turbo and run in that direction okay and if the ball's in your left hand you want to flick the right stick to your right hand and then hold turbo and then flick the left stick to the right so you can run in that direction now to do the momentum behind the back cancellation what you have to do is momentum and as soon as you momentum just flick the right stick down you don't have to bro you have to take your fingers off of every everything so don't even hold turbo after your momentum you want to flick the right stick down all right that's simple. And now the next move is the momentum between the legs. And this is fairly simple. All you have to do is momentum and then flick the right stick diagonally down. So if the ball is in your right hand, when you momentum, you want to flick the right stick diagonally down left. And if the ball is in your right hand, you want to momentum, then flick the right stick diagonally down right. And the next move is the Kyle Lowry or the between the legs size up combo. It's one of the between the legs size up combo. What you have to do with the ball is in your right hand, you want to flick it diagonally down left and then diagonally up right. Okay, and then the next between the legs size of move is you want to flick the right stick. If the ball is in your left hand, you want to flick the right stick diagonally down right and then diagonally down left. And if the ball is in your right hand, you want to flick it diagonally down right. I mean diagonally down left and then diagonally down right. Now, thank you guys for watching the video. Please like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Like I said, let's get 200 likes on this video. Please like, comment, and share the video. Comment if I'm really that nasty, bro, because mixtapes are coming soon. Videos are coming soon, mixtapes are coming soon, my nigga, that 10k mixtape gonna look brazy, bro, I'm telling you, and you just saw a little taste at the beginning, I'm the best dribbler in this game, in my opinion, I'm trying to be humble, but niggas, they don't recognize humble niggas, so I'm, I'm finna, they don't recognize humble people, so I'm finna, you know, I'm do what I gotta do, simple. YouTube, build game later, TGT, that's a CG, 242, yo.